Q on is 6.5. I'm Cindy Campbell saying good morning to Maureen Hancock. How are you today, Maureen? Doing great. How about you? Good. Happy Monday morning. We usually do this later in the week. Are you are you wide awake this morning? Sort of. Okay. <laughs> yes, I am. I get up at 6.30 to drive the kids to school. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm awake. Okay. Awesome. Uh, Maureen, we have uh, Judy with us. Before we talk to Judy, I just want to invite people to get their tickets. Your show is coming up on Thursday, so time is running out. Wow, I cannot wait. Yeah, it's and it's a very uplifting kind of an event. It's not sad. It's um, it's a celebration of life and memories. Awesome. All right. Well, we're looking forward to it. Judy, good morning. How are you? Good morning. I'm fine. How are you? I'm doing great. I'm going to let you say good morning to Maureen and let the two of you talk. So go right ahead. Thank you. Hi, Maureen. Hello. How are you? I'm very well. Thank you. Well, I should already know that, right? <laughs> That's what people <laughs> yeah. say to me. So you have quite a bit of uh, spirits on the other side. And in a moment, I'm going to ask you who you're hoping for. I know there's a a few already kind of gathering, and there's a very strong man waiting to connect with you, uh, which I see, like, to the side of you. Um, and mom is past you? Yes. Okay. She's here, too. Is do you have um, either husband or brother passed? Because this man is next to you, and I have chills. Um, no. And not brother-in-law, because usually next to you is around your age or something like that. No. Oh, okay. So just keep that in the back of your head. Sometimes later on, you're like, oh, you know, and it could even be because it's a, someone around your age, so it could be a, a cousin as well. Yeah. And and um. And also, there's a J name connected to you as well, so I want you to remember that. Now, calling in today, um, who are you hoping to hear from? My father. Okay. All right. Um, your father has a great sense of humor, doesn't he? Kind of that dry wit. Yes. I'm smiling because, he, you know, he's doing the, like, really, we're going to talk to me on the radio? So <laughs> just kind of, like, under the breath. Um, but your mom is there, too, I want you to know. And it's been a long time for her passing? Uh, no, she hasn't passed. Oh, shoot. Oh, there's a woman there. Did you have mother-in-law passed? Uh, my mother-in-law, yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. So I won't get in-law or step or ex attachments. That's why even a brother-in-law can come through. But this woman kind of won't get out of the way. I also want you to remember the name either Elizabeth or Betty is significant, because I'm hearing that. Um, so sometimes we hang up and you're like, oh, you know, that's the old neighbor or, or that kind of thing. Um, right. And your dad, I keep feeling a lot of pressure, like I can't breathe in my chest, um, but he keeps a lot to himself. So never mind, I'm fine, I'm fine. Um, did he have oxygen or something pressing the chest? Uh, he had a massive heart attack. Oh, that's it. Okay. Because I literally feel like someone's sitting on my chest and I can't breathe, but that's how heart attack comes across to me. Um, but that doesn't define him. And he's like, I'm fine. I'm fine. Uh, wow. And does he have a brother that's passed as well? Yeah, two of them. Oh, because he said, I saw my brother. So <laughs> he seemed like really excited, at least for one of them. Wink, wink. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah, no, he, he loved both of them. <laughs> oh, okay. And he, he's just a joker. Um, and probably the one that's been passed the longest, yeah. you know, when they got to have their reunion. Um, the J keeps coming in. Do you know where that comes in? Oh, God. I can't think of anybody. Like right Jane? The Jim? No. Jane? 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 Anyway. just Oh, I know that. a Jane. She was a good friend. Oh, okay. Is is that person passed? Yeah. Hello. I talked to the dead. So, <laughs> you know, because more than just um, relatives can come through. So you have a lot of guardian angels around you. Just know that your dad is your number one, and he hears you all the time because you're the favorite child. You know that, right? Yeah, I knew that. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of love from the heavens above. Thank you. Judy, how was that for you? That was great. Awesome. Your dad's with his brothers. That must make you feel good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thanks so much for joining us. Thank you. Maureen, folks need to get their tickets because that was amazing, and you're going to be doing that Thursday evening live. 
Oh, yeah. It's a million times more powerful in person. Over the phone, it's like 1-800-DIAL-A-DEAD real fast. So <laughs> <laughs> when I can let it breathe and bring some lighthearted humor, it's, it's really a unique experience. Oh, well, great. We can't wait to see you. Folks can get more information and their tickets on our website, q1065.fm.